Welcome back to the TRS video learning series. I'm Greg McCauley, Chief Technical Officer at TRS. And uh, here today, I'd like to talk about contingency planning, what this actually means, some common error likely situations, uh, some available tools to expertly contingency plan, as well as some practical applications or uh, quick stories about how contingency planning or lack thereof uh, hurt us and or helped us in the, uh, in the past. To me, contingency planning is the act of identifying how to resolve concerns uh, that uh, are not really known until you start and in the middle of an outage or major maintenance event. You're playing what if scenarios and you're also validating and identifying what assumptions you know, could be wrong and the outcomes of those uh, wrong assumptions. So again, contingency planning is identifying what and how to resolve uh, conflicts that can arise during the course of an outage. Some of the error likely situations that uh, we are, um, that we may encounter uh, during a major maintenance outage are exposed parts that are not scheduled for uh, replacement. Uh, unexposed parts that uh, will be inspected during the outage, but that are not part of the, uh, the outage uh, replacement uh, scope. Uh, vendor conflicts, such as the number of cranes, the size of cranes, uh, the number and type of skilled craftsmen that you need to uh, perform a certain uh, outage work scope, as well as other specialty services that may be in uh, very short supply, but high demand uh, during peak uh, outage season times. And then certainly uh, logistics uh, can present a lot of, of uh, various challenges and that if we don't contingency plan uh, properly can result in uh, a lot of additional downtime and uh, additional major maintenance spend. And first place to, uh, to start or what we need to learn at the, uh, the beginning is what tools are available to us what tools do we actually have and that we should use to contingency plan properly? Uh, an outage checklist is, uh, may, is a uh, suggested good place to, you know, to start. The process of going through an outage checklist uh, can be a, a very uh, subtle or it can be a very hard uh, you know, reminder of the, you know, the things that, uh, that uh, might go wrong or might not go according to plan during, during an outage. Uh, scenario planning, what are the, the most likely negative outcomes or what am I most likely to, you know, to find when I open up a, a part of a turbine or uh, I am shipping a part from, from uh, New York to uh, California, let's say, uh, and or um, I'm in the middle of a, you know, outage season, I have an emergent need. Uh, what kind of, uh, you know, uh, labor quality am I going to, uh, you know, to find or be able to, uh, you know, have on my project. Uh, and then a, another available tool or resource is uh, GWM Consulting and uh, or your peer experiences. Uh, what mistakes or what uh, error likely situations have occurred on their outages and uh, seeing that I am fixing to uh, to uh, perform the same outage uh, work scope on an identical unit as my peer. What lessons did he learn? And uh, let's ask those specific questions so we can properly uh, contingency plan. So in summary, when I speak about uh, contingency planning, uh, I'm suggesting that we know well beforehand by using available tools and brainstorming what our greatest error likely situations are and what plans, what risk mitigation and or contingency plans do I put into effect? Uh, we make contingency plans where applicable and available, you know, for those primary risks after we have identified what those primary risks or error likely situations are. And then finally, um, we don't, uh, throughout this, uh, this process, suggest that you, you fret, but just know that you are prepared. Uh, we will supply you know, links to uh, some of the tools that we use 
uh, and uh, certainly feel free to contact us, uh, you know, anytime to discuss uh, what your contingency plans are or just to use this as a sounding board to help you better prepare for an upcoming outage. TRS provides turbine component repair, upgrades, and consulting services that combine industry-leading speed, value, and know-how to top operators and manufacturers in the energy sector. Uh, we intend to better educate our customers about managing your risk and helping boost EBITDA and free cash flow in an ever-tightening market. You can find more information about TRS services and our wide variety of services that we offer to our customers at trsservices.com or at 713-692-2930.